welcome back to Windham Mountain. Yes, we're skiing at Windham again, but this time we're not gonna do a big vlog or anything like that. We're just going to capture some of the video of how kids are skiing so we could see everyone's progress. Uh, maybe capture a little bit of how beautiful the scenery is today. And that's it. We're just gonna just gonna do some skiing and um, yeah done if you want to see like a full video how we skied here you can watch last year's vlog it's the exact same thing same hotel same trip same people same clothes you wouldn't even be able to tell the difference that it's a different year oh yeah we gotta get on Hey Dennis, you ready? Okay, so I think at this point I'm a little tired and I think we need to start heading back to the hotel uh, because when you're tired and you're skiing, there's more chance of hurting yourself. That's probably enough for day one. I'm... 
Get up, Dennis, get up. I hate, I hate you. This is not why not, this is World Cup. Why, why don't you like this one? No, these are just small, occasional moguls. Yeah, so you fell, big deal. All right, so Andrew's doing exercise where he's holding poles and he should keep them on the sides of the trail. All right, good, good. Hold them forward a little more. The idea of this exercise is learn not to turn your body sideways but to keep your body always facing down the hill and this is what poles help you to do. All right, this is day two. We are on a really difficult trail. We're on the upper Wolverine and Andrew's going to try a double black diamond. All right, Andrew, let's do it. down this mountain what do you think Andrew was it difficult wait can't hear you stop for a second so was it difficult yeah really in the beginning I was I was scared out of my own wits but then afterwards it actually didn't get too bad we're actually still like halfway on like the double diamond part but I mean like half the trail conquered Nice, good job. All right, let's keep going.
Dennis decided he wants to go ski moguls. What did I say about? <laughs> there is Andrew. Stay away from one another. Control your speed, Dennis. How moguls, Dennis? Difficult? Horrible. Horrible? Okay, Dennis's conclusion, moguls are horrible. Okay, so I'm trying to explain that the turning needs to have rhythm to it, right? And no one kind of understands what I'm talking about or what I'm saying. And the point is, if you want to try to ski moguls, it's like a rhythm that you go one, two, three, four. And then to get there, you need to just do the same thing without moguls. So, let me try skiing and counting that rhythm. So look at my skis and look at me skiing. Hopefully you'll get some idea. We'll go one and two and three and four and five and six and seven. And eight. You see, each turn happens exactly on the count, like music. So that's, I think that's one of the tricks in learning consistent skiing. Well, day two is going great. Boots are feeling good. Skis are feeling awesome. Everyone's having fun. Andrew's been tackling double black diamonds with moguls. Mom's what been toggling, uh, toggling, 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 can't speak anymore. Anyway, towing. Mom's been towing Dennis. What? Yeah, that, I was. That, I don't even know what we're talking about. Anyway, day two is going great. We're having fun. Um, yeah, not much to say. Dennis, how are you feeling over there? Yeah, Dennis's boots aren't doing great. Uh, okay, windy now. Okay, well, yeah, I think it's been a fun trip. We will see you on the next one. Bye.